hello <laughs> welcome 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 to my youtube channel if this is your first time joining you are welcome to a nation <laughs> My name is Revy of Sky Bell Beauty. I'm a YouTuber and a makeup artist based in Port Harcourt, Nigeria. I'm so pumped today because I'm doing a Nigerian tag. <laughs> we just celebrated Democracy Day a few days ago and yeah, I was like, why not? Perfect time to do a Nigerian tag. Arise, oh, come back, draw. If I'm looking down on my phone, I have them right here. Okay. So, okay. So if you want to see a tutorial on this look I have on right here, it's in the description bar. So do check it out. Okay. So my government name, names actually are Uamaka, Joy, Rebecca, Chidima, Izubara, Izubara. <laughs> yeah. Those are my names. Revy, but my government names, you know that name. Uamaka means this child is the best. Chidima means God is good. Um, Rebecca is English. Joy is English. So, yeah. Yes, I was born, bred, and still living and still repping Nigeria. Yes, I was born in Nigeria. I was born in Edo State, Nigeria. I grew up there until I moved to Ghana at the age of 13. Yeah. And then I'm back. Hmm. My favorite Nigerian movie. I have a lot. And nowadays I'm not into Nigerian movies at all because like, yo. But the newer ones though. Ooh, ooh. Wedding party. Yo, that was lit. Wedding party just up the game for Nigerian movies, so I love that. Oldies but good is Tears in Heaven. Oh my goodness, Tears in Heaven has my heart. Ego chineke, ego chineke, ego chineke, on a tomobuto. I wake up this morning, and I so so love I see you. I can't sing my love song. Ego Chineke. That movie made me cry. And Tears in Heaven. Ah, no. I think that was the title, Tears in Heaven. Tears in Heaven. Onome. Ah, anybody that asks my siblings, Onome, as a child, what did I do? That movie is, is a hit. Onome. A good um, Tears in Heaven. And there was this one where that lady always used to cry. I've forgotten her name. Then Sharon Stone. Woo! Genevieve. Killing it since 1900. Okay. I listen to mostly gospel music. Um, so let me just play. There's this one I'm jamming to right now. First, I'm really playing my own, my own jam. You know, my own song. If you didn't know, I'm a recording artist. Yes, I have a couple of hit songs. It's Chris with the number. jam question you can't ask a nigerian their favorite nigerian food because there are so many amazing dishes like where do i even start so my all-time favorites like all-time favorite is eba and oha soup like laced with condiments that's my all-time favorite then we have Potter cuts, bole, and fish. Ayah. If you have not tasted potter cuts, bole, and fish with pepper sauce, 
you are missing. If anything brings you to Port Harcourt and you don't eat bole and fish, ay 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 you are missing. Let me just let me just clear you now. Is it, you are expecting your love. That's like drinking pure water. I, I rest my case. <laughs> ah, you should be asking me the last. <laughs> you should be asking me the last time I left Nigeria because I'm based, born, bred in Nigeria. It's been a while. It's been a while. Okay, and I, I need to travel. Proudly Igbo, eh, one four. Is it both a one four from Abia State? I don't want to say the regular KD, KD Kodi, Idiotole. Ne, what's your name? Le video unka. Is subscribe chala. Is subscribe what? Kedu, KD Kodi. My favorite thing about Nigeria most definitely has to be our spirits. I have never seen any country that has the same spirit and the same vibe that Nigeria has. We are fun, full of life, full of energy, full of passion. We are funny, even in the face of adverse situations. I don't think any, I don't think most Western countries, if they face half, quarter, of the things we experience in Nigeria, I don't think they will be as joyful as we are. In fact, there are countries that live way better off, and then the overall climate is still moody, it's still dull. Despite everything, we are we are happy people, we are fun people, we are hard working. We are hard working people. Trust me, Nigerians are hard working, and we are very resourceful. Whatever you put in our hands, we make good use of it and we multiply it. There you go. This is more of a pet peeve. It's poor customer service. I know you are expecting to hear corruption. We've heard it over and over and over again. It is true, but hey, which country isn't corrupt? Show me one. There are variations of corruptions. I am um, of <laughs> Jesus. Corruptions. There are variations of corruption granted but which country isn't corrupt in one way or another so i wouldn't even let's not beat let's just let that one go poor customer service it's only in nigeria that when you go to an institution like a bank or a shopping mall the attendant feels well it's not only in nigeria but basically they feel entitled if you call customer care if you guys want i can call like my network provider you need to hear the way they respond as though you are begging them it's it, it, it's appalling guys and there are places it's not everywhere but that's just a personal thing for me poor customer service and another main thing for me especially as an influencer is the fact that the environment and the the country is not set up in a way where people with talents and gifts and skills can really really thrive and really really blow up and really really become big it's like you really have to struggle and do everything on your own try to make ends meet up until the point where like people actually start taking notice of you like it takes time for us to catch up like the whole um youtube thing people are still looking at you when you say i'm a youtuber it's like okay i know that there's youtube or what, what do you mean you're a youtuber now nah, everybody's a blogger they just call everybody bloggers and it's it's weird because i don't blog i don't own a blog i don't write a blog i am a youtuber i'm on youtube but you know the system is still it's it's getting there i'm seeing improvements and all but we have a long way to go yes yes my sisters call me ami that's Amaka Ami. And then my mom calls me Uma, which is short form for Chidima. I'm as Nigerian as it gets. So, I, however, however, I would say my uniqueness, my uniqueness lies in the way I think and the way I view my world and the way I see things around me. Um, I don't believe in 
oh nigeria is doomed nigeria is corrupt nigeria can never go anywhere we can never be anything no i have high hopes for nigeria i believe my country i believe that the nigeria will see 20 30 40 50 years from now will be dramatically different because what i'm saying is an uprising of young people who have great ideas who are visionaries who have great aspirations for their country and we are making strides every day to achieve that goal that's why i love the new video with files this is nigeria if you haven't seen that video yet check it out on youtube there are people who are thinking and who have the heart to see nigeria get better so i'm one of them and i believe in my country and i think we are coming watch out world I speak pigeon now. If I don't speak pigeon, maybe I can't speak. <laughs> Everything now, my dress, my should I should I should I bring them? Be right back. Oh so I'm back. So here is one. Excuse this now guys, let me give you the backstory. You see these black parts? You see that? It's called black suits. If you are if you are living in Portacot, you know what I'm talking about. If you're not, Google it. Black suit in Portacot. This was pure white. I hung it on my wall and see, it has become black. So it's not it's not my fault. And then there's this. I'm trying to fit it into the frame. But basically, this is called spatula in English. In Benin, they call it Ikebba. Yes, I I was born and bred in Benin, so it's called Ikebba in Benin. Hey, I've murdered the name. I know I've murdered it. Please, Benin people, forgive me. In Igbo, what was it called? Hey, <laughs> I don't know what this thing is called in my own language. Anyway, this is a bigger version of this um, spatula. We use it to turn. This one is used to turn jello fries and all that party rice. The smaller ones is used to turn a bar. I live in Nigeria, so we don't we don't ask. Oh, when I when I was out of Nigeria, when I was in Ghana, and when I went to South Africa, they kept asking me, "Oh, are you sure you're Nigerian? Are you sure you are Nigerian? You don't have the accents. You don't have the." The Nigerian accent. Hey, you dear, you sound Ghanaian, Papa. No, I don't. <laughs> and I, I can speak tree. It is saying. No worry. When I do a get to know me tag, I'll dive in deeper. You get to know me more. Okay. Let's 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 reserve the tea for later. All right. So that brings me to the end of this video. I enjoyed the video. I hope you did. If you found this video interesting, fun, please hit the like button. Show your who is messaging me now. I'm filming. <laughs> please hit the like button. Show your girl some love. You know, tell me in the comment section what do you love about your country and which country are you from. Thank you so very much for watching my video and remember to thy own self be true. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. One bye. <laughs>